Well, hello everyone and welcome to Diamond Art with Dell. Today I'm introducing my new project that I'm planning to work on. This is a diamond dot square uh, pre-framed piece and um, I'm going to open it up and let you have a look at what I'm hoping to do over the next month, basically. So I thought it would be, I don't know, just a fun project to do. So it's still all nice and bubble wrapped and everything like that. I've had this sitting in my uh, wardrobe there for some time and I thought it was about time I got that out and had a crack at it. So, uh, and, and you know what, I felt like um, a change up. I thought maybe some squares would be a, a nice change from the rounds. So that's what this one is as well. So that will be a bit of fun. Now I'll have to get it all out of the bubbly wrap um, before I give you all the details and so forth and things like that because off the top of my head I have no idea, damn idea anyway. So that's fine. So we will start with that. Now I actually bought this one offline many moons ago um, from Dots Direct I believe. So that's where I originally I think got this one from. But you can purchase it from lots of different places I suppose. The actual um, Diamond Dots website probably still has them. I have no idea. I never bothered checking um, or anything like that. So uh, yeah, just have a look around if you do like the image I guess. But um, yeah, I'm just going to do it as a bit of a fun project just to see what it's like. Let's see now. Dum, 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 dum. Open that up. Ooh. It's all very pretty how it's all put together, these um, diamond dot pre-frames. Oh, all the diamond dots are actually quite nicely put together. So you can see all your drills all packed in the back part of the packaging there. This one is a white frame, so that's kind of cool. You have all the instructions and destructions or whatever you like to call that, um, how it works and so forth. And it's all well um, printed and easy to read, nice big images and so forth if you're new to the craft. So that's kind of cool how they put it all together. And it's got all the lights, nice little um, you know decorative pieces and things. Let's get rid of this bubbly wrap. I might put that away for some other thing later on. Pop that there, it's very noisy, isn't it? So yeah, you can see that's got a nice white frame. These are the drills hidden away up in here. And it comes with a little paper chart. You've got to look after that because that's what you've got to um, know where everything goes, basically. That is your who, who, and what, what. Uh, and without that, you will be lost. So, yeah, nice square drills in here. We'll get them out shortly. But let's check out what the image is. Da, 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 da. We give you our pre frame kit. Yeah, it's diamond area full drill coverage and it is off. Ta da! It is a full drill called Mighty River. This one is an intermediate, it is a 52 by 34 design size and a little bit more than that, like a 53 by 35 frame size. So there you go. And that is the actual image there. So that's going to be very gritty. So let's get it out of this um, protective film. You can see it's got like uh, little cardboard protectors that looks after your frame, etc. Just opening that up just in one of these corners. Sorry about all the glaries. But it's a little bit overcast at the moment. There's Oh, love that. Opening this nice fresh new packaging. So let's see how long it takes me to do this. God, it took me forever to do the last one. So, um, yeah, time to get cracking on a new project. There you go, diamond dot squares. Don't need that. Put that off. Beautiful. Let's need all that lot. Come on, that off. Don't need you. Let's have a beauty look at this. And be gone. <gasps> Whoa. Get off. Ooh, how lovely and smooth does that look? Oh, I do like that. 
Oh, that's very nice. That looks very um, inviting and bright and clean and, you know, all those lovely things that you want to see. Um, the, what do you call it? The drill field looks nicely printed as far as um, clear, not fuzzy wuzzy. And so forth. Got a nice film on it. Nice bright colours. Sorry, I'm in a new spot and I forget that I can't go that way. So, oh, it's got a lovely texture about it. So that's an interesting size and shape and looks like I've got some really nice big blocking areas. You can go to the town with that. So you like the multi-placer, there's some fun areas there. Maybe this won't take too long I save that now, but then I get distracted with other projects. If there goes the drills. Um, and then that goes on. Okay, taking the cardboard out of the back. So taking the cardboard out of the back. Golly gosh. So I say, I get distracted by things. Um, you also have in the back, I better show you all the bits and pieces. These little guys here, these are what um, attaches your string. Your string comes here somewhere, there it is. Um, so you get all this to hang it with, basically, your string and whatnot. You get a lengthy, um, oops, sugar. I nearly swore. <laughs> um, I refrained myself quite well then. Uh, you get a very lengthy, um, a big booklet here on how to and it's really nicely done all different languages etc so if you're new to the craft you've got photos to follow on how to load up your um, drill pens etc so they're very handy especially if you're not you know got no idea at the start there and how to use your little things and things and things yes yes um, so very good I like all that well done now these are also all the lovely drills, which I'm going to get into shortly. But yeah, I'll we'll finish with this first. I don't think there's much else to say. Oh, this um, in here is your table or content or whatever you like to call it. Now, you will need to put that in a safe spot because um, this actual frame doesn't have it on there anyway like it's not on there you flip them over i'll show you the back of them they're beautiful and clean these frames but there's nothing on here at all to indicate what's going on um far as your drill field with these pre-framed pre -framed diamond dots you know that nice and firm boards they're lovely so um when you've got it when you first open it Probably a good idea, maybe just take a photo of it and put it on your in, on your phone, and put it under like a little file or something saying you know diamond painting or something I don't know whatever you like to call it, and so that if you do happen to misplace this piece of paper for whatever reason down the track, you know these things take time to work on, you've at least got a copy of it somewhere that you can maybe reprint, just just for just in case, just in case. So um, yeah. We'll open these up. They'll get into that. So, yeah, this is the drilling field. It looks really nice. I can't really fault it. Now, let's have a look. We've got a nice clear film. Where if I can find the end. Gee Louise. I'm jumping around, I know, but that's okay. We're having a good look. Oh, not too bad. Nice. So that, oh, that's going to be a lot of fun. I was hoping to um, introduce this to you guys now let's part of, do this part of the video so that i can actually get um kitted up later tonight fingers crossed um before this crazy week i've got a crazy month basically and i wanted to get this set up so that i can just in between work away and chip away and hopefully have it done by the end of the month but it's basically it's all about fun today we're not going to worry about the dramas now The precious list as you can see we've got an interesting little mix of characters lots of fun things there and we've got the special little um, diamond dots codes we might get into that a bit closer let's go a little bit down shall we maybe that 
Will that work for us? Let's see. Oh, that nice chunky. Chunky, chunky, chunky. Good some drills. Okay, we have a pretty little kit um, of kit tools and so forth. You get a lovely little sparkly pen. I like that. There's a nice little squidgy widgy. And um, I like these little containers of wax because they're quite handy for when you're traveling and so forth. You know, easy to take with you. A nice little handful of baggies. And the pretty little trays. I like this turquoisey color tray. I mean, they're not bad, the little paws. I've got my own, as you know, the wheels. I like those these days and so forth. But far as the little trays goes, um, yeah, the diamond dot ones are quite nice. But that's handy, the wax I've, and the bag that was good as well. So they are a nice little kit. And we have our square drill. Let's check that out. Mamma mia. What did I, didn't even say, did I? So we have 32 colours. My apologies for those who said, hey, girl, you didn't tell me how many colours you got. This is the program. Sorry, I had a purchase. Um, so where am I? Number one. I'll go over there, we'll do. Gee, they rattle and bang, don't they? All right, we'll just sit them just up there for the minute. That's fine. That's fine. We'll start here with. Ooh, look at that. That's not very well focused, is it? There we go. Um, we'll start just quickly here with number one. Gee, that's a pretty blue. Gee, they're nice and clean, aren't they? I mean, they are diamond dots, and you pay for it, so you'd want them to be good. That's for sure. Now, I know I have a bit of a problem with some of the rounds having static, so hopefully these squares behave themselves when I kick them up later, but I'll let you know. That's about the only thing I have... Um, whoopsie. Sorry. That's about the only problem I have with the diamond dots I find is static. But you can fix that up with, you know, lots of little gimmicks and so forth. But probably the only thing I can say about diamond dots is the static can be a pain in the butt. Look at these pretty colours though. Ooh, look at that lovely sort of peaches and coals and so forth coming through. The squares are nice and clean edged. Oh, look at that. And a little bit of purpley colour. Lots of greens, of course. We've got all that um, tree line and so forth. And of course, we're going to have lots of blue because it's the mighty river. And then we've got the mighty sky looking at us too, by the looks of it. Alright, so that's the first 10. I do like to do it in 10 increments, um, diamond dots. Let's go for the next, going from 11. A nice sort of minty colours. Ooh, that's nice, isn't it, too, that orange. Ooh, very, a bit of shine there. Look at that. Shiny, shine. Pretty. Ooh, that's, um, it's got a softness about it, hasn't it? All these pretty shades of sparkle. There we go. Oops, there we go. Go back down. I was looking at something else. There we go. Just that color. Browns. Just look loose. That's the first 20. Going into 21. This is good as I say. Carefully. Beautiful colors. It uh, looks white in the light there, but it's really not. It's sort of got a... Uh, more it's more buttery cream, that colour, in, re in real, real life, whatever. Oh, that's darker than that too. Oh, nice, nice. Some mauves, some really nice pretty greens as well. So that's 30. Now, where'd the other two get to? Yeah, I got all mixed up, sorry. Um, 30, um, grand finale, 31, and da -da, 32, we have a beautiful white AB, sparkle, sparkle. I assume that's going to glisten through its water and so forth, and clouds or whatever. 
Well, there we are. That is it. That's the only AB we have in this kit, but it's going to look quite pretty. Lots of beautiful colours. Quite lovely once they're all done. So that's pretty much it. I will be putting all those reels into this type of container. Can, I even, can we even see it? That's the question. Um, I'm going to use one of these, these little um, cases, but I don't actually use the case, to be honest. I only use the insert. So what I do is I actually take this out. This one with the little vials. I quite like these. They're very, very handy. They work really well with diamond dots because they hold a ton. And um, I just use the numbers and just keep those stickers on there forever, basically, and then refer to the chart. And this one has 32, so I'll be right because I've got actually 34 stickers. So, um, yeah, I'll be popping them in there. And what I do is actually take this foam insert and I just sit it in, there's a drawer basically next to my desk that I work on. So diamond painting sits on desk, this sits in, insert sits in the drawer next to it so I can um, just have everything handy. I don't actually use this case um, part unless I need to take it these somewhere which is I have done and it's really handy to do because these are firm and handy and so forth but um, yeah they're really really good I do like them don't get me wrong all right so that is pretty much I guess the unboxing and the introduction to my next piece which is this rather beautiful uh, mighty river diamond dots and that's the one we'll be working on and uh, showing you the progress of this one so i'm going to just like i've done before um start somewhere maybe back in this bottom left like i seem to like to do and i will uh progress from there and uh, i'll work through it and i'll just take some screenshots and little developments and so forth I'll probably pop a few up on Instagram or something along the way. So you will see a few little things pop up there if you follow me on that. And um, if you like to sort of see where I'm up to. Um, yeah, this is going to be a lot of fun. I can see that. But I will go and do a few things. And then later on tonight, hopefully get it all kitted up. But yes, looking forward to this one. Let's get started. 